Hello and welcome to another episode of Rover Craft with me, Table. Hello. So we have a request uh, from Louis Louis Johnson, who has requested a tier 9, tier 10 helicopter. So, do we get extra mirror mode? Well, Louis, without further ado, let's build you a helicopter, shall we? Now, tier 9 armour is purpley. Okay. Right, so the first issue you have, the single most important thing you need to consider uh, with helis is rotor positioning. Because without that, really, uh, you're going to get scuppered. Uh, in that, if you don't think ahead of time, uh, that, you know, your rotor blade positioning is kind of what's going to dictate how your heli looks. So let's go ahead and raise that. Now, uh, depending on how far forward I'm going to have my pilot seat, I do, to be honest, want to have a rotor, rotor very near... <laughs> very, got a very deadpan there. Very near. <laughs> very near uh, I don't want my seat too near the front. We're going to go t 10 rotors. Oh, hello. No, don't want that. Let's do that. So they are. Uh, it would seem that they are massive. Okay. So let's just do. Oh, wait. We're not going to be able to do that, are we? So we can't do that, but we can do this. This is going to dictate how our heli looks. Can I go up from there? Yes, I can. Okay. So normally I would use blocks for this, but I'm going to do it with error rods. I just want to see if uh, how much that impacts upon my idea. Doubling up the rotor there would be pretty advantageous. It makes for a very high heli, doesn't it? Hmm. Can I do something with that? I just don't know. Do you know what? I don't. I want to have something that at least kind of looks like a helicopter. No, I don't want it to be. I don't want necessarily want it to be ugly. Ah, underside rotors. That's what we can do. I can put in a rotor right uh, here. There we go. Underside rotor. Now we do need to consider shielding. That's very important. Uh, but I do want more rotors. Survivability. Or do I? I think I'm going about this all the, the, the wrong way. Definitely going about this the wrong way. So let's make sure that we have that on. Take off all of this. How stable or unstable is one rotor blade? That's the question I want to ask. <laughs> <laughs> if it's really, if it's relatively stable, then I might just keep one rotor. However, we do need to think survivability. We do need to think of a way that this vehicle, uh, if shot down, can still survive. Wheels are quite big. It might have to be hovers. So, yeah, one rotor doesn't really do it, does it? <laughs> we just make a body that looks good, and then we add uh, some rotors on it. I guess that's what we're going to do. We <laughs> haven't got too far yet in this design. <laughs> okay, so let's pick up the pace. Let's get this, uh, let's get this idea forming. Uh, that looks fantastic. Let's do that. Yeah, mirror mode. No mirror mode. I forgot here. Okay, so we're going to do that. And we're going to go bing bing. Bunk, bunk, bunk. Bunk, 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 bunk. Bunk, bunk, bunk. Bunk. Good. Uh, we're going to go rink, dink. Rink, dink, dink. Bink, bink. Bonk, bonk. Bink, bink. Then we're going to go down here and do one, and we're going to go like that. Okay, we don't want to go much bigger than that. That's pretty much uh, how I want it to look. So movement, I'm going to put on some, let's put on the nines, nine, nine hovers. Mm. Let's just do that. And let's just do that. That's all the hover I want to have on, on this vehicle. To be honest, that's all I'm going to do. Um, the chassis, uh, these, and then we want to put on these blocks here just to strengthen. <clears throat> well, not so much strengthen, but add some additional protection. Uh, for our hover pads, but I don't want it to be too. I don't want it to be too excessive. I don't necessarily want to put on uh, much armor, if I'm honest. Oh wait, a uh, plasma, plasma. Okay, plasma heli. Okay, so we've got our hover pads on there. Uh, let's do that, and I'm going to go ahead and do this as well. Okay, so we're going to and then. I'm just going to do that, okay? That's going to happen. That can become one of those. There we go. Okay. 
So you're looking good. You're looking pretty. Uh, do I want to extend the back out? Um, no, actually, I don't. I don't want to extend the back. I will do that though. And then we'll put in prism there and there. We can go ahead and move that and do that. This, I suspect, is going to be some kind of staging area for a second rotor. But really, I want to just. Uh, hmm. What am I doing here? What is going on here with this section? Hmm. I'm just, I'm just winging it. I'm just winging it. I'm just trying to get a feel for what I want it to look like. I mean, I do want it to function, obviously. It would be really nice if it did function, and it will, uh, to some degree or another. <laughs> but, I mean, I'd rather it do well. Okay, so we're going to have that. Um, it looks quite menacing, doesn't it? Okay, so we've got this. Uh, let's go ahead and just do that there. Hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. I feel you. I feel you. I see. I see where you're going here. Well, I don't know. I don't see where I'm going with this actually. But it's a very pleasing shape. That's for sure. So I can just fully enclose that bit there. Got the hovers peeking out. Looks like little eyes. Uh, do you need to do something under here? So let's go like that. Uh, I want to mount shear. Oh, hello. That's a big problem right there when the seat is exposed like that. So I want to put in some shields, but I don't want to put them in just yet because I want to essentially see what on earth I'm doing here with this bit. So let's do that and this. Okay. Right, hardware. Definitely need shields. Definitely need shields on the underside. Okay. Um, no, that's not the ones I'm thinking of. Uh, maybe it's these are the ones I'm thinking of. Yeah, these are the ones I'm thinking of. Okay, so what's preventing me from doing that? Ah, oh, the shields themselves are preventing me from doing that. So if I go like that, okay. Uh, I should have put the shields on first. Um, boop. So there. And then we need to return that prism to its spot. We need to strengthen this, I guess. Mm. Okay, why not me? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. This area is kind of uh, big. I can probably get away with doing that. There we go. Okay. So there's a little extra character there on the underside. Little extra weight, uh, chassis, two of those. Okay. And you know what? It is a heli. I might do that. I don't know how that's gonna. This is gonna impact upon the hoveriness. But I can you see what I'm doing here? I'm gonna I'm gonna put on an underside plasma. Or am I? Oh, I guess I will. <laughs> so indecisive. Oh, maybe I will, maybe I won't. Let's put it on and see. Uh, and let's just go in and see how it performs. Just go straight in. Go straight in, see how it does. Rotor positioning is going to be an issue. I mean, where I'm putting this plasma, I could just as easily put a rotor, which I might do, because if you're going to have... Yeah, well, we'll have to see. Let's have a little looky. Well, so the hovers do, it does hover, so if it, if it happens to, to fall down, it will hover. Oh, nice. Put its shields on. Okay, right. Back to that ship. Relaxed, I'll be honest, I feel pretty relaxed. Just having a nice relaxing heli, heli hover machine, which can be a bit of a nightmare. I'll be honest, they sometimes can. So, we have a shape, we have some shielding. I'm, I want to put on some additional shielding. I don't, it doesn't need to be a massive bot, this, but I do want some additional shielding. Ooh. That's kind of nice. Kind of like that. Can I get on some here as well? Hmm. They are kind of nice, those shields. Oh, no, I want it the other side, actually. Let's do, uh, let's do that. Hmm. 
Well, isn't that very good? <laughs> I seem surprised that that something could actually uh, could actually pay off like that. I seem almost surprised. I know what you're thinking. What what have you just done there, Taylor? That is ugly. And it is. I'm just trying to see if I can uh, do something like this. Something a little cheeky. No, okay, I can't. I clearly can't. Okay. So let's leave those bits on. You're kind of cute, aren't you? You are kind of cute. Right, rotors. Have to have rotors now. Um... Let's go there, uh, <laughs> I made a <laughs> I made a helicopter, 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 it's a helicopter, helicopter, can I get a bit in there, no, not at all, okay, okay, so we've got one, one, one rotor in, can I do that as well? Should I do that? Oh, I am. I'm going to do that. Okay. So we've got one rotary. I do want to have... Uh, do I want an underside rotor? I do. Sorry. That does. It does look like it was meant to be. What's going on with the... <laughs> what happened there? Okay, so... Uh, now we want plasma. Uh, tier 10 plasma. That would have been too good if that worked. It feels like it could work though. If I do that and bring them forward. But it will have to be that one. Let's try again with that. It felt like it could work. And it does. So if it works there, would it work there? Oh, okay. Yeah, it does. Okay, that's good. So we've got some plasma. Let's just uh, clean that up a little bit. Hmm, okay. So we've got two plasmas. Um, that was just too much to ask, wasn't it, really? Come on. Come on. Just let me put the plasma on there. there. Okay. So we've got two plasmas. Um... Do we need to go to Max P flops? Like, really, honestly, uh, I mean, what do I want to do here? Uh, what am I doing here? I'm just pressing. <laughs> uh, let's go. Um, error rods, error rods. Where are they? Come on. Bingo. Let's put one on right there. And then let's go like this. Yeah, let's do that. But then this bit's kind of ugly, so let's just move them like that and like that. And then, uh, hmm, what, what am I doing here? Uh, curly, curly air rods, curly curls, curly curls, curlies, curlies. That's high enough, though. Mm. Design improvement. Now, I am pressing a lot of buttons here. <laughs> that was that was a lot of. I haven't quite remastered the. Uh, don't forget, you can hold you can hold control uh, and by multiples. You can see I'm clicking left and right. There we go. Okay. Right, man. This is a casual build. Casual, casual yet long build. <laughs> Prisms. Let's uh, have that. Oh no, wait. I've got to go like this. Let's do that. Okay. Mm, let's have this like that. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Uh, prism. Man, I'm really getting focused into this build. Really getting uh, concentration level max. It's not necessary, you know, but well, no, it is necessary with these difficult builds. Okay, that I like the look of that back section. That looks nice. Okay, now we're beginning to look like a helicopter. Uh, we're looking like something, that's for sure. Ah, uh, do you know what? 
I could probably have got away with mounting something there. Really? I feel like I could have maybe have achieved something with that. There we go. What are you? <laughs> okay, so there's another plasma there, which most likely won't hit anything ever. <laughs> but I, I'm not too concerned. It, it can stay. It can stay. It might. It might. It might prove uh, valuable. That bottom rotor really is getting in the way, isn't it? Like, it really is stopping me from deploying an awful lot of downward plasma. Okay. Two, four. Okay, if you're going to have two rotors, then you're just going to have to make up for it with shielding. Okay, so 900. Let's, uh, let's add more shields, and I think we're good. Uh, these, I love these shields so much. They are just absolutely delicious as far as shields go, in my opinion. That's really nice. Those two join up really, really nice. Okay, let's uh, let's try and get um, I, does that look okay? No, that doesn't, does it? Although I could I could put them there and have that kind of overlap. It's kind of nice. You know what? It's so nice that I want to want to do something else with those. I want to go like this. Let's just see if it's possible. But it looks so nice. I wanna, I wanna do that. Okay, we can do that. That's a nice, uh, nice array of shielding down there. Um, I do wanna just bash buttons wildly. <laughs> I feel like I can get a shield there. Oh, I can. Okay. You know what? You can just be shielded. I can just have a lot of shields on you. It's fine. Can I get some more in there? Looks like maybe I can. <gasps> oh, now you're looking really serious. Uh, plasmas, two, four, six. I got six. Let's take it into a little practice. Have I inadvertently built something that, if losing, if loses rotors, can hover? Uh, it's heavily shielded. Looks good. Can it fight? I don't know. I don't know. So you definitely hover. Let's see if I can take off, which I can. Next section, next issue. So I've got to break free of the hover. All bombs go on target. Hmm, okay. You're kind of, oh, you are kind of sexy. <laughs> I, I'm gonna put some thrusters on it. I can put it, Margaret 9 thrusters on. Uh, right, the tail. The tail's kind of weak. Um, kind of a little bit weak. And I tell you what, if I can put two there, I can definitely put two on the back here. Like here. Ah, oh, come on. Meant to be. Meant to be. Is there anywhere else I can get put some cheeky shielding on? Mm, I mean, you could, but do you want to, is the question. You don't want to get too carried away. Although, it feels like maybe something can go on there. No. Oh, but it wants to. You can see that it wants to. Mm. 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 No, let's go to movement. Movement, thrusters, uh, Mark IVs. So we can go in under the wing here. Oh, wow, you really... We can put, uh, we can put a couple in there. Okay, good. Uh, feels like I can squeeze something in here, which I can. Fantastic. Let's just slide those in there. Uh, turning thrust, turning thrust, somewhere around here. You can have it there. That's fine. Uh, cockpit. Right, so I do want to have a cockpit. Uh, and if I'm honest, I would prefer it to be a bubble, but well, it's not going to happen, is it? Let's be honest, it's not going to happen. Uh, so let's go like this, that, uh, that, uh, boop, and then put those. 
goes in like that. And then the, it can be here. We can put it here. We can put it here. It's fine. We can just. Oh, but it looks ugly. Does it look like too much of an afterthought is the question. Maybe if I do that. Then that bit looks weird. That doesn't look so bad actually. Okay, good. So let's remove that and put that in there. That needs to become a prism. You know what? That kind of works. But if I can do it there, then I can do the same here. Like, why why not do the same there? Make that a, one of those. And it can be a two-stage heli. It can have that extra, that extra section. Like, it's no, it's no, uh, it's no issue to, to put that on. It's not going to compromise anything. It's just going to look delicious. I can put that there. Oh, yeah, fantastic. Okay. We could stop there, maybe. Let's take it out for one last flight. And uh, I think we're there. Louis, I think we got the heli. I know, you, I know you didn't say anything about shields. I know I got carried away with the shields, uh, and I've only got two rotors on. But with the hovers, I feel more confident in that it's going to be able to, you know, get back to base and heal. Turns, uh, turns nicely, goes forward. Okay, uh, let's try the overclock level. See how it does at 13. Seems alright to me. Plasma's a little bit off, but you're gonna get that with those sideway mounts on the on the sides of the heli. We're there, that's it, that's the heli. Yes! Success! <laughs> So there we have it, uh, Plasma Heli, uh, I don't know what I call it, good, 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 uh, but that's it really, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with how it turned out. It's always difficult uh, to build these things first time, but I like it. I've been Table, thanks so much for watching, uh, if you've got anything that you want to see or what you want me to do, just let me know and I'll do it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and also most importantly take care of yourself and also, oh yeah, the final thing, uh, but I really like making videos. I just want to say that. Can I say that? Like, yeah, I really enjoy it. Uh, and also, finally, bye!